and now for something completely different. Um, it is my great pleasure and honor to announce the winners of uh, the prize that we established last year called SALUS, the prize for best policy paper. This prize, this competition was established last year by the Belgrade Center for Security Policy and the Belgrade Security Forum to support uh, students at the Faculty of Political Sciences uh, in their uh, writing of their papers at the courses Introduction to Security Studies, Security of Serbia, and Security Sector Reform. So this is the second year in a row that we have this competition. And uh, I can tell you that the competition has been tougher and tougher. The papers have been really uh, improving. Um, and this year, we have three uh, really extraordinary pa policy papers. Uh, the competition and the, the decision um, which papers to, to actually give the prize was very, very difficult because we had like more than 100 of excellent, uh, really excellent papers. Uh, but we had to make a choice and to narrow down the selection to, to three papers. And now I'm going to uh, simply call the winners of the, the best papers to come uh, to shake hands with me and to have a small photo opportunity and to receive the uh, diploma. So the third prize uh, goes to a paper uh, titled Violence Leads to Violence. Let's... Uh, um, make a wake-up call. I'm translating now from the Serbia. Nasilja ostavlja tragove, zvonimo na ne nasilje. It's a little bit uh, uh, tricky to, to translate. So I call um, Jovana Đurović, Milana Đurović, and Mila Aleksić to come to the floor to <laughs> shake hands. Testitam, congratulations. The second prize goes to a paper titled Systematizuj, Optimizuj, Reforma Kadrovske politike u policiji Srbije or Systematize, Optimize, Reform of uh, Human Resource Policy in the Serbian Police. I call Emilia Dimitrijević and Irina Stojanović to come to the floor. Your colleague, Emilia Dosha. Okay, I'll give them a photo. Congratulations. And last but not the least, the first prize goes to a paper called Deca bez pratnje u pratnji zakona i institucija or freestyle translation, unaccompanied minors uh, followed by laws and institutions, let's say so. So I call Milica Mietovic and Nikola Cukic. Your friend is not here. That's it. I invite all other students to maybe, uh, yeah, come here and have a group uh, photo. And uh, maybe uh, Nicola and Marco can come because they were supervising the work of the students. And thank you all for your patience and check the websites of the Belgrade Center for Security Policy, www.bezbednost.org, and you will be able to download policy papers uh, which are going to be published uh, shortly. Thank you very much. <laughs>